Taken off from the world's busiest airport, Hartsfield Jackson is bracing for more than 300,000 travelers today. AAA predicts nearly half of all people living in Georgia are going to go on vacation somewhere. 11 Alive's Jerry Carnes reports what you should expect if you are driving or going to the airport. At the age of 35, Quentin Price celebrated his birthday with his first trip by plane. And I just came back from Mexico to LA and had an overnight stay in um, New Orleans. Back home after a trip to Vegas, Chesley Johnson is looking forward to her next trip in just over a month. We're going to Texas in May, right when school gets out. We didn't travel with COVID for a long time, so we are traveling more. They are two examples of the rising demand for air travel. Hartsfield Jackson is preparing for a springtime peak of 335,000 passengers on March 29th as Metro Atlanta students head out for spring break. The airport expects to see nearly 8 million people over a three-week period, ending when students return from spring break. Travel expert Lori Garrow says you can expect to find flights booked full and sometimes overbooked, which could provide opportunities if you're flexible. So, for example, I was at the airport. The gate agent was offering up to $1,000 gift cards to take a later flight um, to get to London. So, yes, you can definitely save money or get few, or travel vouchers. If you plan to travel by car, demand for fuel is rising, along with the price. Gas Buddy predicts prices won't hit a springtime peak until as late as May, when the national average could flirt with $4 a gallon. If it's summertime travel that's on your mind, Gas Buddy's forecast has Memorial Day as the priciest holiday of the year, when the national average will be anywhere from $3.56 to $4.04 a gallon. All right, maybe your family's like mine, having a staycation, getting some things done around the house.